the great mother in her many aspects, maiden, raging warrior, benevolent mother, death-dealing and all-wise crone, unknowable and ultimate weird, is now powerful, re-emerging and rising again in human consciousness. Isis, Maulisa, Ezeli Dantor, Demeter, Gaia, Shakti, Astarte, Shekinah, Rhea, Freya, Brigid, call her what you may. She has been with us from the beginning and awaits us now. She is the beauty of the green earth the life-giving waters, the consuming fire, the radiant moon, and the fiery sun. She is star goddess and spider woman. She weaves the luminous web that creates the universe. As Earth, the great planetary spirit being, she germinates life within her dark womb. Greetings and welcome back to inspired messages i am goddess nini and today we honor the divine feminine goddess annapurna annapurna or annapurna is the hindu goddess of nourishment anna means food and grains purna means full complete and perfect she is a form of Parvati, who is one of the numerous forms of Shakti. Annapurna is the goddess of the city of Kashi. Kashi is also known as the city of light. Ka means the cause. A means, a means the manifestation of consciousness. Sa means peace, and I is the casual body. So Kashi is also the place which causes consciousness to manifest the highest peace of the casual body. And she is the supreme goddess of the city of Kashi. Annapurna, goddess Annapurna, oh, oh, providing food to those in need. According to tradition, Annapurna watches over the world's storehouse, storehouses when supplies wane and over the storehouses of souls. Goddess Annapurna's themes are providence, prosperity, and charity. Her symbols are corn and grain. Today is an excellent day to give canned goods to a local food pantry or shelter, especially corn or grain products. The canning process preserves Annapurna's energy for providence to help those less fortunate turn their lives around in powerful ways or at least helps them, helps them to reclaim some sense of dignity. So today, say a brief prayer over the goods before giving them away so the goddess can bless and inspire renewal for those in need. To honor Annapurna's providence in your home today, take any grain product and sprinkle it around the outside perimeter of the dwelling. The birds will carry your need to the goddess. If you must perform this spell indoors, sweep up the grain in a clockwise manner and keep it in an airtight container to preserve its positive energy. Release a pinch of this to a northerly wind anytime you need money quickly. Honoring the Divine Feminine, Goddess Annapurna. The Goddess is changeless and eternal. Her magic works outside of time and outside human convention. Take the time to look at, appreciate, honor, and internalize the sacred energies of the Goddess in her truly meaningful ways as it resonates with you. Thank you for listening and until next time, one love.